and time. Okay? You do that? So get one, two, three. Okay, so nanalo mo kami dalawa. So, brothers and sisters, what we're trying to say is, bakit bang may game na ganito, ano? What, what, what does this something to do with communication? So, the art of communication, no? Art! Art is an expression of skill and imagination. It is something you can be creative about and improve its time, no? Pwede naman kasi na sa game, your objective is na manalo ka, no? You win. Pero hindi naman sinabi sa game na pwedeng manalo yung dalawa, di ba? So, being creative says na we need to think outside the box. We need to think na kung ano yung unang, usually kasi yung unang pumupunta sa isip natin na solusyon, hindi pa yun yung pinakamagandang solusyon. So, during communication, because communication doesn't come to us naturally, we need to be creative about it. That's why we need to have the art of communication. Then communication, it's the act or process, the act or process of using words, sounds, signs, or behaviors to express or exchange information, ideas, thoughts, or feelings to someone else. So, like what we did a while ago, di ba, dun sa game. So, my husband, Raynor, was able to express well what he wanted to tell me. Di ba? Nasabi niya ng mahusay, nag-express niya sa akin, sinabi niya, Lilipat ka dito. Lilipat din ako sa'yo para pareho tayong manalo. Ah, na-express niya ng mahusay. At ako naman, naintindihan ko. Nag-gets ko ang sinabi niya. So, I was, uh, I was able, we were able to exchange information and ideas. So, nag-gets ko yung sinabi niya. Intindihan ko. So, sinabi ko, ay, oo, oh, oh. sige, lilipat din ako sa'yo. And in that way, di ba, both of us win. So, that's communication. Express and exchanging information. Now, we have the three components of communication. So what are they? First is the sender, who is the one who speaks. The message, yun yung kinokonvey, di ba? What to say. And the receiver, the one who listens. So, the one who listens, not just hear. Kasi pag sinabi mo hear, narinig. Pero yung listen, nakikinig. And as sending, as well as receiving, yun ang kailangan nating dalawang yun para maganda yung communication natin. Hindi pwedeng maganda lang tayo mag-send, hirap tayo mag-receive. Hindi rin pwedeng receive lang tayo ng receive, hirap tayo mag-send. Okay? In fact, as far as I remember, kung nag-aaral pa tayo, di ba? May subject bang talking 101? Meron? Pwede ka lang, listening 101? Wala, no? Okay. Most of our learnings come from trial and error. Most of our learnings come from what we see sa ating mga parents o sa ating mga kaibigan. And because of that, in the process, we learn bad habits. We learn bad habits, mga bagay-bagay na that stops us from talking and listening well. At the same time, dagdag mo pa, sabi nga kanina, men and women talk differently. Wala po kasi yung kapatid na babae, no? And then, hindi kami close ng mother ko. In a way, uh, I, I, I wish we had been closer. So, later ko lang nalaman na iba pala mag-usap nga yung men and women. In fact, kung tatanungin ako ng kasama ko, oh, kumusta yung lakad? Ayos! <laughs> isang, isang salita lang, ano? Pero kung tatanungin naman yung asawa ko, kamusta yung lakad nyo? Ay, ayos pa sa ayos! Ang dami namin ginawa! Alam mo ba, nagpunta kami sa ganito! Okay. So, what I'm trying to say, men gives few words, Men gives few details, but women gives a lot of details and maraming napapag-usapan. So, dun pa lang, how would you communicate as husband and wife given those differences? And our goal this afternoon, brothers and sisters, is we make sure na to learn how to communicate as husband and wife, to listen also as husband and wife. Interesting ba? Yes. Kailangan ba? Yes. Oo naman. Kasi kung hindi po, pwede nang umuwi. Just kidding. Okay. So there are different barriers to talking, or different reasons why people are reluctant to talk. Iba-iba. And uh, una, some, this is based on the research, by the way, you know, this is based on the research. Some people say, ah, hindi na lang ako magsasabi kasi I won't be able to express myself clearly. Baka hindi lang ako maintindihan ng aking asawa. 
Huwag na lang. Some people say naman, especially the men, no? men kasi by nature, we want to, ano, we, importante in a way sa men to, no? I don't want to sound weak. Sabi ng partner ko, ng wife ko, weak ako. Kahimik na lang. No? Or, pwede rin na reason, my spouse won't be interested. No? For our case, I'm an engineer by profession, so my wife has nothing to do with the with engineering, so paano ko ba i-discuss yung aking trabaho sa kanya? So, but we can talk about other things, but this is one reason also why men and women sometimes hindi nag-uusap. For some, no, I don't want them to worry about, for example, we have the husband or the wife has a problem. Instead, I share niya, ako na lang, kaya ko naman to eh. Ayoko mag-worry yung aking partner, no, ang aking asawa. For some naman, I don't know where to start. So, pareho lang to sa I won't be able to express myself clearly. Deleted sila. Or, I don't want to disturb peace. No? I don't want to upset her or him. No? Baka mag-away kami. Huwag na lang. Huwag na lang kayo mag-usap. Or, ah, hindi naman ito importante. Maraming pa kayong pag-uusapan. No, when my wife and I were, were doing this uh, exercise, Ako, I can relate to that. You know, I don't want to disturb this. I don't want to upset her. Kasi growing up, my father is like, uh, parang hindi naman sundalo, pero my father is like yung typical na parang Spanish na, na parents, ano? Bawal kami mag, ano, mag, uh, bawal magbigay ng katwiran. Pag tinatanong ka, or ako, hindi na ako sasagot kasi lalo akong papaluhin, no? So, I grew up na, sabi ko, magtatahibig na lang ako, mag-away power mapaparusahan pa ako. So when I was in our relationship as husband and wife, this is one of the things that I need to learn how to outgrow. No? Kasi nung una, hindi na ako bata. Wala naman yung parents ko. So I need to unlearn this. No? Ito yung isa sa mga difficulty ko na I don't want to disturb this. But by the grace of God, and by the love of my wife, and uh, uh, by the experience na hindi naman kami nag-aaway, even if I share something, I outgrow that one. Okay. So we have exercise. Okay, so okay ba yung intro introduction pala yan. But uh, please proceed to page 11 of your manuals. So we'll have the first exercise for session 2, which is the barriers to talking. So a while ago, kanina na discuss ni Raynor yung mga barriers and also in your manuals nandiyan, di ba? I believe nakasulat siya. So, uh, six minutes or six, we'll give you six minutes, three minutes for husband and three minutes for wife. So, you take a few minutes to look at it together, no? yung diagram, and tell each other kung meron ba na mga barriers that applies to you. Okay? Yeah. So, discuss it. So, three minutes for husband and three minutes for wife. Thank you. 